Now, I asked the doctor who performed the surgery what was the response from the patient after it was over, and he says she told him this wasn't as bad as I thought. So, so we're just going to talk about the protocol itself? Yep. Dr. Lloyd Zucker is the chief of neurosurgery at Delray Medical Center. The hospital is the first in Florida to treat an Alzheimer's patient using non-invasive bocus ultrasound waves. There's a plaque in Alzheimer's that people have you know, heard about, and there's a way to look at areas that have more plaque than others. And we're using the ultrasound to open the blood-brain barrier in those areas to hopefully reduce the amount of plaque that's there. The patient who enrolled in the clinical trial received the first of three treatments February 15th. In two weeks, she'll get her second treatment, and then two weeks she'll get her third treatment. So we observe her and make sure between one and two and two and three that there have been no negative changes. The response from the patient after the first treatment? Basically looked at me and she said, this wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. And I'm like, well, I'm very glad to hear that. Jonathan Weiss is with the company behind this technology. We're able to create temporary windows that they can get right in, right to their targets. He says they're offering hope to millions of patients and families affected by the disease. This is looking into the future. How can we do the right research, bring together the right partners to find a way to discover next generation treatment solutions for these patients and, basic, and save people. Now for more information about the clinical trial, you can just download our app and click on this story. Angela Rozier, WPBF 25 News.